Decentralized finance refers to financial services that operate entirely on blockchain networks, rather than through intermediaries like banks. Decentralized finance services run on open source software code, they can be combined and modified in almost endless ways. They rely on public blockchains, where transaction data can be viewed by anyone and is immutable, meaning it can't be changed or tampered with. Decentralized finance brings decentralized exchanges, or DEX, with it. Decentralized exchange is a peer-to-peer -peer marketplace where transactions occur directly between crypto traders. DEXs substitute intermediaries, traditionally, banks, brokers, payment processors, or other institutions, with blockchain-based smart contracts that facilitate the exchange of assets. Today we will investigate one of the decentralized exchanges, which aims to create a more free and inclusive financial system through decentralization. By providing the unrestricted and unprecedented ability, to express diverse views in the decentralized financial markets, we are striving to empower individuals with the ability to more efficiently allocate capital, in our society. I'm Joey from KK Technologies. Let's discover Injective, a truly free and decentralized financial network for everyone. Injective Protocol INJ, is a decentralized exchange, DEX protocol that offers advanced features like cross-chain margin trading, derivatives, forex, synthetics, and futures trading. This permissionless DeFi platform also supports perpetual swaps. The protocol's tech stack accelerates trade execution and settlement on Layer 2 while remaining fully decentralized. Because Injective is completely decentralized, anyone can create and trade derivatives markets. Injective Protocol is made up of several components that support the functionality and development of its decentralized exchange. Injective Chain The Injective Chain is a decentralized exchange DEX protocol built on Cosmos that also allows for the transferring and trading of Ethereum tokens. It operates as a completely decentralized sidechain relayer network. The Tendiment Consensus method is used by Injective Chain, and Cosmos SDK modules implement the protocol's essential logic. It built to support Ethereum-compatible DeFi applications that reach instant finality, sub-2-second block times, and lightning-fast transaction speeds 10,000 plus TPS. The Injective Chain is a fully decentralized sidechain relayer network which serves as a Layer 2 derivatives platform, a trade execution coordinator, and a decentralized order book. Validators witness the locking of Ethereum assets and sign a data package containing information about the lock, which is then relayed to the injective chain and witnessed by the ETH bridge module. Once a quorum of validators has confirmed that the transaction's information is valid, the funds are released by the Oracle module, and transferred to the intended recipient's address. In this way, Ethereum assets can be transferred to Cosmos SDK-based blockchains. For interacting with the protocol, Injective offers a user-friendly front-end interface that may be operated locally or hosted on a web server by both people and businesses. The interplanetary file system uses this interface as well IPFS. These tools provide a decentralized peer-to-peer -peer exchange, which is nothing new, but the features added to the ecosystem setting the Injective protocol distinctive. To sum up, INJ aims at resolving common issues of the financial world by making use of the decentralized blockchain industry. It allows all investors to have authority on injective chain network. Cryptocurrencies are highly volatile, so your cash can go down as well as up in the blink of an eye. As always, you should never invest in something you don't understand. What are your thoughts about the injective? Would you use or invest in it? Let me know in the comment section below. Thanks for watching. If you find this video helpful, Please tap the subscribe button, 